Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I will show you how to answer this one. I will put about B equals to this one and Q equals to this one. So in this one, we need to do first the derivative of B with respect to Y. So this one we have number one. This one we got 4y to the power of 3. So after we do first the derivative, this one we have dy. So we need to put, we need to find the cube over the x. This one you got two x number three and number two. We have number six. This one we have number one. So if we look carefully, this one, this one and this one, they are not the same. So that is not about exact. But if we look in this one, we can do about factorization by y. And we can see that we can see about the same common this one and this one in here. And if we use this one minus 2x and this one minus this one, so we have 4x plus 2y to the power of 3. So if we put number 2 outside and we got the same common in here. So in this situation, we need to transform into exact and we need to we need to select about mu y that means we need to multiply both sides by this one and now we want this one equals to this one so for this one we need to do first the derivative of this one later that we can do first the derivative of mu y this is about the product rule of the derivative So we have y equals to ab. So if we do first the derivative of y, we need to do first the derivative of a multiplied by b plus first the derivative of b multiplied by a. So in this one, we have like this. And this one, we need to do first the derivative of x only. Now, if we simplify, we have like this. This is for s. So you got 6x. Next, I will put this one go to the right. So 6x minus 2x, we have 4x. This one minus this one. Uh, uh, I forget number 4 in here. So this one minus this one. So we have number two. 
Now, we can do about factorization by y. This one by number 2. Later that, we divide both sides by this one. Next, we divide both sides by mu y and y. Next, we put the integration for the both sides. So this one, we have number 2 fn of the absolute value of y. But in this situation, we can put about y. This one, we put fn of mu y. So I will put number 2 go inside about this one. And mu y equal to y square. So that means we multiply both sides by y square. Now, y square multiplied by y and y to the power of 4. Now, about this one, we can put the dp over dy for this one, and you got about 6sy to the power of 2, and this one we have 6y to the power of 5. This one, you got 6sy square and 6y to the power of 5. So we can see that this is about exact. Now, we need to put fsy equals to the integration. That is about this one. And we have 3sy. So, the integration of qs that is about s square y to the power of 3. This one that is about s. Next, we need to do first the derivative of f with respect to y. So this one that is about 3 y to the power of 2. This one that is about 6y to the power of 5. So we know that this one equals to this one. Now we simplify for the both sides and you got number 0. So we put the integration for the both sides. The integration of number 0 you got about C. Now we go back in here. The integration of this one that is about 3sy. 3sy equals to C. And this one equals to fsy. fsy equals to C. And now we have the final answer. This is the end.
Thank you for watching.